one in the UEFA Champions League. Who will get off to a flying start? It's Villarreal. They face Manchester United. And it's live on EA TV. A passionate night in store, no doubt, here at the Estadio de la Ceramica in Spain. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting next to me here on the commentary gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham United midfield man, Stuart Robson. And what we have for you tonight is live Champions League group stage match day one action. It's Villarreal versus Manchester United. Well, thanks, Derek. This is such an important game. Both sides will be desperate to start this group well. Let's hope we see some great football today. Villarreal starting 11. Sergio Asenjo is the man between the posts. Francis Coquelin plays with Danny Parejo in central midfield. And it's two strikers up front who will look to provide the goal-scoring threat. The lineup for Manchester United. David De Gea begins in goal. Rafael Varane plays alongside Harry Maguire in central defence. Bruno Fernandes plays with Fred in central midfield. And leading the line today is Cristiano Ronaldo. It's the opening match day. Champions League group stage match day one underway. Technique display. Rashford in the middle. Not away completely. Ronaldo. Shot attempted. And a goal! Not bad for starters. They take an early lead. Well, just look how he holds off the defender. He keeps his balance and he still hits the target. What a good goal that is. Back underway in this game, Manchester United with the advantage. Useful looking position, you've got to say. Moreno. Now he must favour the cross. That is how to put in a challenge. He's been a bit unlucky to concede the corner. to pick out a teammate and an effective clearance difficult to stop him
Could play it in. Can he put it away? Oh, yes! A goal! Exactly what they were looking for, and he's come up with it. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace, and his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. Cristiano Ronaldo. Sancho. Happy to take on the shot. A goal! And it seems they're truly cruising to victory here. Well, here it is again. And if you are going to clear the ball, you have to get height and distance on it to give your defence time to readjust. And they don't do that. It's a poor clearance. And suddenly, the ball's in the back of the net. left his marker for dead and blocked for now Ronaldo is at the far post still possibilities right over for now it seems well he's gone back to give the free kick the referee here he tried to play advantage but it didn't accrue Gerard Moreno. Now Cocora. Ruben Peña. Cocora. Alcacer. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw in. Sancho, here is Fred, Diogo Dallo, this is the man you met it. oh just wide of the mark, goal kick, well that never looked like troubling the keeper did it, but it was worth an effort, a good strike from him. Intelligent threaded pass here. How can he take them on and beat them? And it might be a goal here, giving his team precisely what they were looking for. Now he deserves to celebrate it. Well, let's look at this again. He's done superbly well to pick out a teammate here. And then the shot is emphatic. He strikes it with such power, the keeper has no time to react. What a good finish. So on with the action. And 3-1 the scoreline at the moment. Alex Tellez has it. Bruno Fernandes. Fred with it. Rafael Varane. 
Well, at the moment, they just can't get near the ball. And you can fully understand the crowd's reaction. They expect much more from their team. Can he finish this? Good work to win it back high up the pitch. Moreno. And intercepts again. Considerable momentum, courtesy of Ronaldo. But what can he produce from here? Determined defending. Well, on the cusp of the half-time interval, and I think it's fair to say they're enjoying this away day. Stuart, what have you made of what you've seen? Yeah, they're playing really well here. They've controlled the flow of the game, they've won their individual battles, and they've created numerous chances. Their only problem in the second half could be complacency, but I can't see that happening. Perfect example of how to put in a tackle, and a corner will be next. Well, they haven't seen too many chances, but the crowd sensing this could be a turning point. They need a goal here. And now the delivery. Not away completely. Parejo. Delivered into the box. Let's see this again, because the delivery into the box couldn't be any better. Played into just the right area, and the strike could not get any better. He hit through the back of the ball with such power. What a goal this is. And the ball is moving again. 3-2. He continues his run. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Alcantar. And here's Gerard Moreno. Perfectly positioned to take it away. Two minutes of stoppage time coming up. Roy Gomez. Pule Dia. Alcacer. This could square the game. Behind in the game, but now they have a corner. Well, it's been a while, but these fans are now coming to life. Can they equalise here? Let's see about the delivery. Not really the ideal clearance. And with that, the first half draws to a close. Well, no doubt about it, Stuart. Cristiano Ronaldo in the first half deserving all the superlatives going. Well, I thought he had a very good first half. And key to that was his movement. Time and time again, he got in behind the opposition and he was a real threat throughout the game. And I'm sure we're going to see more of him in the second half. And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. It's with Alex Tennis. Now, what can they do from here? And Ronaldo prepared to fire. Well, it didn't really work the keeper when all was said and done. Alex Tellez. Bruno Fernandes has it. Firing it in and diving to thwart him.
Who can he pick out? And the corner, too close to the goalkeeper that time. I'm delighted to say more Premier League action coming up for you here on EA TV. It's Manchester United facing West Ham United. Coquelin. Dia. I must say this looks promising. But they took care of the situation defensively. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. All hands on deck. Ronaldo cutting inside here. And the keeper got there. The substitution will occur now. <laughs> Trying to deliver it accurately. But he took care of it defensively. This is Nemanja Matic. Cross fired over. Not messing around with that clearance. Counter-attacking, very much an option. But quick thinking defensively. Now we're into the final half hour. Rashford. It needs an accurate cross. Surely! Did he really save that? Sergio Asenjo, brilliant! Now sending it in. Well, he dealt with that ball played in rather well. Sancho. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. Moy Gomez. Excellent refereeing. Advantage in operation. And it's United's turn now. Ronaldo. Ball with Ibora. Paco Alcata. Moving into the advanced position. Hule Dia. It will be claimed by the keeper. Matic. Fred with it. Well, they couldn't keep possession. Well, the fans believe there's hope here. Can the players respond now? Showing patience, looking for the equaliser. Well, I think a classic commentator's curse just then. Couldn't make the ideal pass. Well, that'll be a free kick. To the box it goes. Not fantastic defending. Let's see if it helps the opposition. Could be a chance to break here. Matic. Fred. Diogo Dalot. 
United might be able to cash in. How about the cross? Ronaldo just couldn't capitalise there. Well, every second must seem rather like a minute if you're a United fan. They're almost there, almost over the line. Stuart, what have you made of their performance today? Well, what a finale we have here. Both sides have looked good going forward, but poor defensively. But I do think they have been the better side for much of this game. They just need to defend their box with determination in these last few minutes. Diogo Dallo. Given away by Manchester United. How can they turn one of these attacks into a goal? And delivered towards the back post. Terrific piece of anticipation. Well, the corner it is, and they know they've got to be opportunistic at this stage of the game. Here's a change for Manchester United. He's driven in the corner. Well, the clearance half-hearted. Trigueros. Parejo. Trigueros. Alcácer. Ibora. Plays it back. One of the saves of the season from De Gea. A corner then, and with time running out, they've got to ask questions. And United will switch things around personnel-wise. Trying to deliver it accurately. It might still be... This could level it. Well, the keeper is happy the bar was there. Well, just couldn't keep the ball. Now he must favour the cross. Oh, managing to beat him. Oh, a penalty. Not at all what they wanted with time running out. Well, he's avoided a booking, but the complaints continue. And I can understand why. I think it's a poor foul. It should be a yellow card for me. Chance to equalise here. Oh, the crossbar is still reverberating. Bruno Fernandes. Excellent vision. Getting forward. McTominay. This could finish it. And in all likelihood, that is game over. So little time left for a response. Well, here it is again. He hits this so sweetly, doesn't he? That's a brilliant goal from a top-class player. So full time it is, and a morale boosting three points on the board to begin their European campaign. Yeah, that's a good win and a vital three points. Another win next time out, and they'll be in a great position. Well, a very positive experience from the point of view of Fred, you've got to say, Stuart. Well, he did everything today. His energy, skill and movement was just too good for those defenders. It was a really good display.